Welcome back to Mute Season with me, Mute here. I'm back with Resident Evil 1. It's the remastered remake and <laughs> Origins collection. Yep, I played this on Switch and also recorded using Switch. So, yeah, I think we just got onto this place, right? So, this is going to be. A new exploration of this new area. I think we could expect everything to be safer here. Instead of on the original. I think so, pretty believe so. Oh yeah, the boulder. <laughs> uh, blood stand underneath the boulder. Great, awesome. You pretty believe on the original, uh, this place is kind of overrun by hunters. Okay, not happening here. That's nice. Maybe not yet. Oh no. Oh no, it's the original. Yeah, okay. A herb that is then. I kind of, I, I kind of thought that I will have a an ad spray here. Proved to be wrong. I see something shiny over here, though. And gun magazine, right? Awesome. Something shiny again over here. Another handgun magazine! Wow! What is this supposed to mean, game? You want me to fight the hunter using a handgun? <laughs> is that what you're saying here? That's kind of crazy! <laughs> now nah, we're just going to run it. We just save. We just load the game. What happened? <sighs> Double crosser. Enrico, wait. Enrico! Ah. Um, well. Uh. Enrico! Double crosser. Killed him with just one shot. Who could, who could it be? Can't be Wesker, right? Wait, he's holding something. Oh! <laughs> Thank goodness I check, isn't it? Cause somehow I thought the crank would be left behind uh, on that uh, corridor before before this one. The hallway or whatever you want to name it because I think that's how it goes on the original yeah here you just just keep shouting I don't want to hear it just going to leave it with you okay we good we good Examine it. The end is shaped like a hexagon. It's an octagon crank. <laughs> it's a hexagon, Chris. A huge gaping hole. Wonder what it was stuck for. Gold. Oh, 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 recording time, like right there, in front of two hunters, yeah, can't be better, right, can't have a better time than that. 
Don't want to waste my magnum now. Don't think so. Yeah, we got a lot of handgun clip. Maybe need to start to use handgun again at some point. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I remember this part. <laughs> I'm so sorry with that. Kind of remembering this part. Um, um, I need a knife, right? Yeah. Will I need a shotgun or not, though? We're just going to run it, right? We're just going to run it, or we, or we're going to fight it. Uh, I don't know. Decision, decision. Always hard to make. There you go. We will need this. We will need this. Dang. Too much space is already been taken away now. Really want to leave this weapon. But that means I will not fight it. There is a no go. It's okay with Jill, not with Chris. We will fight. Oh, what the heck? It's not necessary to use it just now. I've been using it a lot. Okay. Just miss like a little bit of bits. And it just denies me. Just can't believe it. Do I need to save again now? <laughs> I want to. <laughs> but um maybe not need to. Ah green herb there. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Green herb is a green herb. Yeah, of course, right? Green herb is a green herb, of course. <laughs> Oh. 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 <laughs> uh, I'm thinking about leaving my shotgun again now. Because um, the game gave us a weapon here. Yeah, let's just do that. Let's just do that. We just spent like about 8 minutes in the game anyway. Even if I died. Even if I did, I could just simply load it again, right? And try to get uh, to reach this point in no time. So let's just leave these, because the game provide the weapon to us. That means I could bring another healing with me. Hooray! Will that be enough? I hope that'll be enough. Dang, look at me! Going around with just a knife! Like a very brave man? <laughs> oh, yeah, we're, gonna, we're gonna see that. We're gonna prove that. Will you take the flame tower? Doesn't, doesn't really have a choice here, right? Need to take it with me. Ah, oh, the camera could kill us here, though. The huge boulder blocks the way. Okay, I'm waiting for the beeping. <laughs> the one that got killed because of the beeping. So, yeah, please wait for a second. All right, let's go. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Okay, that's a long loading to make Chris jumping. Good to have, right? Good to have. Oh, I need to bring shotgun here. Okay. Gonna wait to say uh, to give this hint towards me, game. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't know. The memory says that there's going to be hunters showing up, but um, it's not happening. Oh, this one. Yeah, you you don't really need to fight this boss, but we're going to fight it because we are crazy. Redo Fildo. Oh, 
those spider sands? Ooh, oh wow, they are very easy to be defeated, apparently. Ah, oh, dang it, recording. <laughs> oh, make me got hurt by this one spider. Oh, we still fine. I don't really need to bring these. Yeah, always so. Oh, wow. Flame Tower is so, so, so. It, this is a knife, right? Yeah, just in case we are forget to bring the knife, the game will provide it to for us. And um, that's why I think Resident Evil Zero, although well, the mechanic could be annoying at times, but it could be helpful also sometimes. But you could just throw some items like this knife after you use it. You don't really need it again anymore. You don't want it anymore, just throw it there, right? There's a map of the Koya B1. Take it. Yeah, take it, take it. Okay. Yeah, get kind of confused there because I thought, haven't I took some map of basement one before? And um, it's not a courtyard basement one before, right? It's a uh, it's the mansion, I think. But um, oh well, whatever. Dang, is this really a hard mode? Why are the bosses died so fast? <laughs> because we defeated using a right weapon, maybe. The spider of fear of fire. That's what maybe, right? But everything fears a fire. Me included. Okay. Ah, great. Another boulder. What a great time to die. <laughs> Alright, so this began to be a little bit tricky for the first timer. Even I forgot, although this is also on the original. Okay. Oh, right, right, right. Nothing will happen if you still don't get it right, I think. Yeah, so you don't go back. On the first boulder, boulder you run uh, on the opposite way of the boulder which means you are getting chased but on this one we really need to risk it to reach this opening that we just opened could be kind of tricky but um yeah <laughs> okay one spot one slot i mean not spot uh yeah, we need to enter this statue towards this hole. That is obvious. The got a statue smiles silently back at you. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Seeing that uh, mechanism on the left there reminds me of what I need to do here. Good. I'm kind of questioning myself how to do this again and then... There you go. Yeah, a lot of hard works going on here. Involving muscle and tools. Exactly not for Rebecca. Come on, Gudas. Let's go over here. It. Wait a minute. It's not turning? I need it to be turning again. Who made all of this? George Trevor? You deserve to die, dude. <laughs> I mean, why? Doesn't make much sense, right? 
even for umbrella employees. Boulder everywhere. Oh, too much. Oh no, not too much. Okay, that's that maybe. Okay. Ah. Will you take the cylinder? Wait a minute. That's not all. Where did I miss the other part? A circular metal object with a hole in the center. Symbols are carved in its side. Yeah, I remember it like there is there is another part of that item. Where to get it? I think I'm supposed to have it by now. Oh no. Oh, maybe it's on the place where I need to use it. I'm just going to help so. Okay, I'm going to need this again. That means... <sighs> I need to use either of this or this. This will get me a defense up. Just in case... A hunter shows up, right? Yeah, let's just use this one. Might be a wrong decision, but who cares? I made those uh, bad decisions like all the time. I pretty believe that... Um, wow, that is almost an unseen door. Looks like a wall. Feels like a wall. Oh, 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 no, no, no. <laughs> Dang. Dude. God damn. <laughs> uh, 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 glad to be alive. <laughs> okay. All right. That's one a good sport for the heart, right? Let's bring our shotgun back. For what? Just to feel safe. Do I really need this shotgun with me? Let me think about it. We're just going to go there and we're going to meet there and then there and then there. I think so. Okay, maybe not. So let's just leave it. I hope you do understand that. If you don't, I don't know if I care for now. Magnum revolver. Yeah, I don't think I will need any of this item for now. I think so. So let's uh, go. I got my shotgun. I'm doing good. Okay. Remember, we still leave two hunters here. I hope they become friendly now. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Recording. Well, thank goodness the hunters has a need to, like, um, um, not inform. What is the words? Like, uh, telling us that they are there. They're screaming. Okay, okay. The item is here. Thank goodness. If it's not here, I don't remember where. So, examine. It appears to be some sort of key to start the power supply. Symbols are carved in its side. Yeah, I don't I don't understand how this works, but um we'll combine it and then examine it. Cylinder shout. Turn it. Okay, it's a very easy puzzle, I just don't remember the number, but um, I think we could see it, right? It's 4231. I don't know if we really need to like turn it until it form a clear number, but um, yeah, let's just do that. 
Yeah. Four, two, three, one. Use it. A series of flashing buttons. Which button will I press? Oh no! Four. Oh, wait a minute. What? What is it? Again? <laughs> four, two, three, one, or four, three, two, one? Four, two. Okay. Well, pretty easy. Pretty easy to forget too. Okay. Yeah, you don't really need to take out all of those hunters. Thank goodness I still remember. If that would be the case. Yeah, the problem with the with my playthrough of Resident Evil Zero is I forget like most of that adventures. So I don't know what to expect on that room. What kind of enemy? Should I defeat the enemy or should I just let it go? But th but the thing is, why Resident Evil Zero felt like harder uh, than this game, and also that layer, it's it's more because of the more more small uh, a smaller corridor where you just can get through the enemy you need to face them and spend your bullet to defeat them here you could save a lot of ammo if you already know that there's going to be a zombie there we could just go past them don't need to defeat them and everything like that just like with the hunters okay Okay, we don't like how it sound. All right, absolutely don't like what I see. It's that thing again that they say that. Um, 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 um. Cannot do anything about her. No bullet could harm her, so just run away. Uh, the thing about her though, she's always going to show up uh, the first time in this place. Uh, she's going to show up on... Um, yeah, I forget what the point... <laughs> what point I'm trying to make here? She's going to go everywhere you're going to go first. So, I, I choose the right side before, the right path. But if I choose the left part, she's, we're going to meet her anyway, so... Yeah. Mostly like that. That's exactly what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Alright, the... The other thing that makes this Resident Evil 1, like, m easier than Resident Evil 0 is... The fact that shotgun only took one slot to be carried along. So do with grenade launcher, I pretty believe so. And also flame tower. While this on Resident Evil Zero, they're most likely going to be two slot things. A device for transporting materials. Yep. You know how it goes, Chris. You see a button, you press it. You see a hole, you jumped. Okay. Yeah, let's prove my theory. I pretty believe so that she's going to, like, uh, shows up wherever you go first, so. 